From FOMO to no go, let's check this out guys. Sleepless and bored at the moment, so I thought I'd share my ape story. After the GME squeeze happened last year, one of my buddies made a lot of money. AMC had a little mini squeeze, but the price still seemed affordable at $70 when GME was at $300. And me being myself only did a tiny bit of research and was convinced AMC had the potential to squeeze even higher. So I bought 20 shares. I wanted in on that squeeze money. I didn't want to miss out on the action. Well, ever since then, AMC has gone nowhere but down. But you know what? I keep buying and buying and buying. Because in eight months since I joined the party, I've come to a realization that there are multitudes of retail investors like me who are buying and holding and buying and holding. If the stock price is dropping, even when hype is everywhere and demand is high, it seems clear to me that the market manipulation is happening and the price isn't even real. I bought 20 shares of AMC at $64 last spring because of FOMO. Now I'm holding 205 shares at an average cost of $38. And I will keep buying and holding because I believe in AMC, because I like the stock, because I still think that all of you and other apes and me still have a chance at making a bunch of money while we bankrupt these manipulative hedge funds. Because I want to send a message, and hopefully someday, sooner than later, I can pay off my mortgage and retire at the age of 60, so I can at least enjoy my older ages. That's all I want. Is that too much to ask? More than half my life savings is invested in AMC, and my portfolio is now down over 50%. If it drops away to zero, not much has changed. I'll be low middle class working until I'm old and decrepit. But if we can make this happen, then I can finally have the financial freedom. We can all send a message that will bring a revolutionary change. But either way, I'm part of this community. I'm happy to be a part of it. I love that camaraderies that I have. I log on here every day to uplift the spirits. I'm here with all you to the end. I am not leaving. We have what they need. We are in control. We set the price. Don't sell yourself short, pun intended. Also cross post from SS, link in comments to it. This is the easiest thing in the world. You own the asset. The only way they can get the asset is if you sell it. I don't get my price targets. They don't get my shares. I know there are many others like me, especially after these long months of all this BS. If they wanted my shares for 1K, they shouldn't have turned off the buy button in January and allowed me a full year to learn about what's actually going on. Really good point there. Now the MOAS is inevitable. They don't tell me anything. SEC, government, anyone. They want my shares? Well, pay up. I don't care about how many adjectives, now, number, shill accounts. These guys give some schmuck with a keyboard to waste days trying to convince me what I'm going to sell at. I will sell or I won't. And you can be damn sure I won't if the government sets a price after being absent landlord for decades. But that scenario is just a shill fantasy anyway. An outcome that wants you to believe or even one they are secretly praying for. It will be supply and demand. And I demand their utter liquidation and removal from whoever's participating in the markets again. If you let someone dupe into selling for one grand and exactly one week later, the share sells for millions, that's on you. Because that is exactly what is coming. This thing is going to the millions, whether you are there for it or not. This rocket isn't going to stop because you jumped off. I, for one, will not be on the wrong side of the bell curve because I bought into some hedge fund FUD fiction. When the smoke clears, post Moaz, post Black Swan, post True Price Discovery, and GME and AMC still sit in the five figures or more because there are only 75 million shares that exist, you have a lifetime to relish or regret your decision. If you want FUD, that is the FUD you should be looking for. If you guys are specifically still holding, I'm really curious, comment down below yes if you're still holding and also comment down below your target price you'd be willing to sell for. But if you want to stay up to date with everything else that's going on with AMC, because trust me, there's a lot more to go through, make sure to please subscribe to my channel with notifications turned on so you never miss out on a video. Also, drop a like on this video for some good luck moving forward for AMC. And lastly, go to the second link down below in my description and join my private exclusive Discord server. Thanks as always, guys, and I'll see you in the next one.